too early to put the tree up, not for some who want to start spreading Christmas cheer early this year. But with the rule of six still in place, families are frantically rearranging their Christmas plans, with some fearing turkey dinner at home alone. Has Covid stolen the spirit of Christmas? For some, that most magical time of the year can't come soon enough, especially in a year that's been miserable for so many. But with the rule of six still firmly in place and the threat of it continuing, many families fear they won't be able to spend Christmas together. The Prime Minister has said things will be bumpy until Christmas and beyond, but more recently promised the festive season will be relatively normal. Twelve weeks today is Christmas Day. Are you saying to families of five that they can't have both grandparents around for Christmas lunch? We're, we're, we're not saying that at all. We'll do everything we can. So you'll, you'll let them off the rules? Everything we can. Every, listen, everything we can to make sure that Christmas for everybody is as normal as possible. Other religious celebrations have taken place on a much smaller scale this year, including Eid and Rosh Hashanah. And the pandemic has already taken some festive family favourites out of the equation. Pantomime dames have recently been protesting against a lack of government support, as they won't be on stage this year. Other casualties include London's Winter Wonderland and a host of Christmas markets around the UK. Love that. OK, very good. Even Santas are being taught how to be Covid secure. With all those rules and cancellations, are people still getting excited? Well, Ellie Pilcher and her family certainly are. Her mum has already been hand-making Christmas decorations, but things will be much more scaled down than usual. This is the first year where actually Christmas is just going to happen just on Christmas Day and we're not seeing anybody, uh, we're not going to be socialising at all, not having any of the in-laws or the great aunts or grandparents over. It's purely going to be parents and children and that is it. Um, we quite, haven't quite got to the point of getting the Christmas tree down yet, but uh, I wouldn't put it past my mum. Um, but yes, we do have, uh, we've got the Christmas cooking is underway soon with the Christmas puddings and we've got some decorations in the works and Advent and wreaths. I think Christmas for us is going to come early from the 1st of November onwards. It's it's going to be Christmas songs and Christmas cooking and Christmas decorations everywhere. While for some, October is far too soon for the twinkly Christmas lights, department stores have started selling decorations even earlier this year. And with good reason too, the Christmas shop in John Lewis has already reported sales increases of up to 300% on last year. Jason Billings Cray is the chain's Christmas buyer. People are just really excited to look forward to, look forward to something. Christmas is such a, a pivotal time of year, really important to families. So to get excited about something, start preparing, is a real nice uh, start to the festive season. No one really knows how old Christmas is going to be this year, but I'm, I'm sure it'll be one to remember. But being at home, it's an opportunity to really indulge and make sure your house is looking super festive. In fact, Christmas trees are so popular at the moment that Christmas Tree World, based in Lancashire, fear they could sell out before the usual November rush. It's normally businesses that are ordering, but what we're seeing this year is a massive increase in the general public ordering. They're normally November time, but, you know, it's gone crazy. Are you quite surprised by that? We are. Um, we, what we were expecting was a bit of a, a lull um, with businesses not ordering, but you know we're, we're talking you know way over double um, in terms of the number of orders that are coming in at this time of year, and you know it, it's been the same since really June, July. People are just willing Christmas to be here sooner. You know, a bit of joy, um, like you say, into into the home. You know, it's been a difficult year for everybody, really. While October seems a bit early to celebrate Christmas, it seems many are doing what they can to make it come sooner this year. With less people to celebrate with and more time at home, it means more time to decorate and spread some Christmas cheer.